Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch and I have good news of sorts for developers for the worst possible reason and that is the entire content of 3D Buzz is now available for free. You can download all of their courses, all of their materials, everything. Now if you've never heard of 3D Buzz, it was one of the first training sites online. What you see in front of you right now, this is 3dbuzz.com from uh, the Wayback Machine. So right now, as we will see in a few minutes, this is not what the homepage looks like anymore. But this was a repository for courses between programming, art, and design. And like I said, it started back in like early 2000s. So before there was a Udemy or anything else like that, there was 3D Buzz. And they have created dozens and dozens and dozens of courses, literally hundreds to thousands of hours of material. And they have made all of those courses available for free for download. So that is the topic of this video. Now, unfortunately, there is a terrible reason why this has happened. So now we're going to head over to 3dbuzz.com as it exists now. And we are there. Now, one thing you'll notice when you first try to get to this guy, you may get a, kind of a security warning. There seems to be an SSL certificate issue with this web page. Um, just know that it doesn't seem to be a big deal. Uh, but there are a couple things to be aware of. Now, the first thing here is they are shutting down. 3D Buzz closed their doors. All the subscriptions and payments have been suspended. Uh, page is the final gift to the entire community. Below you will find download links to all of our available material free of charge. Thank you for your many years of support. You're all truly the best community anyone could hope for. May we see each other again um, somewhere in the ether. Thanks from all of us. Um, to all of you, remember to always look, listen, and learn. Goodbye, good health, and good luck. So uh, instead of just shutting their doors and going away forever, 3D Buzz basically just made all of their content available as free downloads. Now, some of these are really large downloads, but before we move on, let's talk about the terrible side of the story. The reason why this happened is the primary or one of the primaries behind 3D Buzz unfortunately passed away in 2017 of cancer. So the site has carried on a little bit since then, but it's just not viable anymore. They're not making new content. Everything here is starting to get a bit dated. So they did um, the, uh, the nicest thing possible and made everything available to everybody. I think we can pause for just one moment here. And if there's one thing that the entire world agrees on, it's that cancer sucks. Screw cancer. Uh, screw you know, there's really no other way to put it. Cancer is a terrible beast and I hope you never have to deal with it. But it seems like at this point in time, everybody everywhere in some way has unfortunately been touched by cancer. And this, this is kind of the, the thing that happens is if you die and you have a legacy, what do you do with that legacy? And in this case, they did something really cool and they made it available for everyone. So what exactly, let's go back to, you know, less dire conversations and we'll look at what is available here. Now do keep in mind that a ton of this course stuff is, um, a little bit dated at this point in time, but some of this stuff never gets old. Some of this stuff is still relevant today, and there's just so much here. In fact, there are 200 plus gigabytes of content here, and these are available as direct downloads on a course by course basis. Some people have done uh, rips of this and are making uh, torrents available. We'll cover that in just a second. But you'll see here some of the courses we've got here. 2D artwork, 2D game art for non-artists, 3DS Max, legacy video training. By the way, almost all this is video courses. In fact, all of it is video courses. Uh, a bunch of 3DS stuff. Now keep in mind, this is going to be for a very early version of 3D Studios Max. And we got some After Effects training, AI behavioral systems, AI pathfinding with um, A plus or A star. And A star pathfinding is kind of a universalism. So even if this is a little bit dated or might use an earlier version of a programming language, the contents are just as valid. Uh, then we start getting into some, the, again, some of the content was very wide ranging. So we've got some here for um, model view container programming in ASP.net. Um, so again, there's a bit of a here. Uh, intermediate scripting with C-sharp, Blender 101. So this stuff is back from 2012. Uh, so this is Blender 2.73, I think it was at the time. Uh, a couple of courses there, Blender Complete. Uh, building 2D games using C++, iPhone applications from the ground up, C-sharp, 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 C-sharp. We'll just kind of keep glossing over because there is a ton of content here. We've got some C++ courses, uh, Chibi artwork. Uh, I'm not much of an anime guy, but isn't Chibi the super deformed stuff? Um, we got comprehensive ASP.NET MVC again, creating 2D games in Unity. Here you see, again, some of the stuff is starting to show its date, uh, 4.5, so it's quite a few versions out of date. Uh, Third-person character... Um, Third-person character and camera systems with C-sharp, uh, creating compelling character concepts. So again, that's the kind of stuff that will last forever. Um, 
creating concept artwork, creating plugins with Unreal Engine 4, CryEngine 3, comprehensive introduction, uh, developing modular rigging systems with Python, Doom 3 modding, drawing 102 anatomy, again, one of those things that never really gets old, uh, drawing steampunk and fantasy art, Far Cry level development, uh, game assets in 3D Studios Max, a couple other 3D Studios Max things, a GIMP tutorial, HDRI, Houdini stuff, um, more Houdini, more Houdini, more Houdini, more Houdini, uh, more Houdini. We're Houdiniing still. Okay, so we got an Objective C crash course, Android development again, back from 2012. Introduction to F Sharp, Photon Server, uh, Subversion, Windows Phone 8, uh, Learn to Draw 101, 3D Studios Max stuff again, Maya courses here, and it just kind of keeps going and going and going. So we got more Maya, more Maya. MMO development, this is one of their bigger courses. So basically from beginning to end, we've got concept art for um, an MMO, development class uh, for creating an MMO, uh, MMO playtesting. Uh, so let's keep going. we got some modern JavaScript and HTML. Um, Objective-C again, some Photoshop courses, practical game development in Unity 4 again. So as you can see, there are a wide swath of courses here. And some of them, again, a little outdated. So, you know, Unreal Engine or um, the back one was called UDK. This is going to be almost useless at this point in time. But the courses on how to draw are definitely still valid. And even really when you look at the stuff that Unreal does now or Unity does uh, now, even though it's a number of versions out of date, uh, it's still probably, you know, 80 to 90 percent valid. Ditto for programming games using C Sharp or, you know, XNA stuff that you're seeing right now. If you're working with mono game, XNA and mono game really haven't diverged all that much. So it should still be pretty useful to you. And then to close it all off, we got some courses in ZBrush. So there is a ton of content available in this drop. And as you can see, once again, each thing is uh, download. It's available on Backblaze B2, which I think is like an S3 competitor. I don't know what kind of course, um, kind of download speeds we should expect. So there's one coming down right now. And it's coming in at 10 megabytes per second on my connection. And that download is a 600 megabyte. I don't actually need to grab that. That zip file is 600 megs in size. So you can see they're using a cloud service and it's a decent download speed. Now, as I mentioned earlier on, um, there is a Reddit thread, and in the Reddit thread, there's a bit of a backstory about what's going on. Unfortunately, once again, confirms that uh, Jason Busby, one of the main principals behind uh, this entire course, is uh, he, he did pass away of cancer, unfortunately. Um, and they're kind of winding things down. You come in here, though, you will see a number of people are setting up torrents. Um, so you see some torrent links right here. I have no idea if they actually are working great uh, or not, uh, but you can get a little bit of the backstory here. Uh, unfortunately, again, it's, it's not really a nice story, uh, but if you are looking for uh, a torrent option, uh, there are a couple in this link, and I will toss that in my linked article down below. So uh, there are hundreds of hours of courseware, some new, some, sorry, some stale dated, some still quite valuable, and it is really cool of them to have made this move. So, um, you know, if you are looking for training, oops, that's the wrong thing. Uh, if you are looking for training material, this is, you know, it's definitely a place to check out. Again, once put into one giant torrent, this is something like 210 gigabytes worth of content. Or at least for now, all of these things are available for a, a pretty reasonable download because they are on this uh, CDN delivery network. So if you do want to check things out, even though obviously it's, it's going to be hosting a lot of downloads, it still seems to be doing uh, pretty good from a performance perspective. So there is a ton here. I figured I would point this out to you. And you know what? In closing, once again, screw cancer. I think we can all agree on that. But uh, it's really class of what 3D Buzz here did. You know, this cuff could have just all sunsetted and gone off into the ether and never been seen again. But instead, they made a ton of courses that were previously uh, commercial courses that you would have paid, you know, 35 bucks a month or 40, 50, 60 dollars for um, each individual course well before there was even a Udemy. Uh, now all of that content is available free and that is a class move. Uh, I hate that, that it took such a terrible thing to get us here, but again, uh, uh, my my applauding to the uh, 3D Buzz community for making this stuff uh, available free and uh, you know, once again, my condolences to Jason's family. All right, that's it. I will uh, talk to you all later. Goodbye.